Okay, so in this video, we're going to go over how to set up a budget in QuickBooks Desktop. Um, this is quickly a short overview on how to set up a budget uh, for the company. So let's go to Company, Planning and Budgeting, Set Up Budgets. And I already entered some information. However, I want to show you two things. Number one, if I hit Clear, it's going to clear the entire budget, just in case you want to do that. And uh, if I hit Create New Budget, uh, no, I don't want to save that. We can create a whole new one. So let's start there. Here, we're going to choose what year we want to create the budget for. And then here we want to choose, is it for profit and loss or balance sheet? So if the if the budget is for your profit and loss, it's just, it's just going to be for your revenues, for your cost of goods sold, and your operating expenses. If you do the, uh, the budget for the balance sheet, it's going to be for your assets and your liabilities. In this case, we're going to do it for the profit and loss. Hit next. And we're going to do it for the whole company. We're not doing it for a specific customer. Hit next and finish. Okay, so back to here. We already have this information. I'm going to clear it. Are you sure you want to clear? Yes. All right. So in construction income, I'm going to say I project I'm going to have in revenue 120,000. Uh, construction, you can start filling in the numbers. putting random numbers at this point just as an example um, maybe 100 25 5, okay so if every month the expense is going to be the same or you project it's going to be roughly the same then what you can do for example rent would be an example that would be a fixed expense I can just hit copy across then you'll have the 5,000 across the board. Telephone will be roughly the same. Utilities will fluctuate a little bit, but let's say that's our budget. Insurance should be roughly the same. Auto expense, give or take. Workers comp as well. Subcontractors can fluctuate, so then you can go month by month and fill it in. Maybe you won't have anybody in February you'll have somebody in March and so on so it's good to see your historical data look at what happened uh, last year pull up your profit and loss break it down by month so that you can start seeing how the, the year performed and you can set your budget based on that I'm just gonna hit copy across for the example and hit OK beautiful so that's how you set up a budget um, in uh, QuickBooks Desktop. If you want to edit the budget, you simply go back to set up budgets and every all the information you entered will be there. Hit save and okay, and you'll be good to go. Another place you can go to is budgets and forecast. You can see your entire budget overview. Here we're gonna select the budget. This is the one we just created. So hit next. We want to see it by month. Hit next and finish. So now you'll see here we have 120, 120, 120, as we had said. And uh, it's for uh, from January 1st, whole month of January, February, and March till the 6th. And if I just want to see one month, I just do. your budget if you like this video please make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe thank you so much